हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू त्रिगुमा एकेडमी आई एम साकेत मिश्रा वेलकम सी यू ऑल ऑन द लर्निंग प्लेटफॉर्म टुडे वी विल डिस्कस हाउ कैन वी यू नो हाउ कैन वी बिकम अ सर्टिफाइड एप्लीकेशन डेवलपर ऑफ द सर्विस नाउ सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस व्हाट आर द एग्जाम स्पेसिफिकेशन ऑफ द कैड ओके कैड मीन्स वैन आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट कैट दैट मीन्स सर्टिफाइड एप्लीकेशन डेवलपर सो वी विल डिस्कस वॉट आर द free conditions and the eligibility criteria for the certified application developer exam in service now and we will discuss what type of uh, you know questions are coming in certified application developer program so today we will discuss around 50 60 questions of uh, you can say the scad dumps which will help you to understand the exam a uh, point of view and this will also help you to understand how you can improve your career in service now itself okay so guys this video will help you a lot and first of all i would like to thank you all for giving me your love for my service now system administrator dumps video that video i hope that video will help you a lot and i received lot of emails and uh, messages i i am trying my best to respond for each email and uh, message okay if i missed any your message extremely sorry for that but yes uh, because uh, due to the heavy uh, uh, heavy messages i might be i i missed some messages but yes I, i was trying my best to respond to you guys and i would request you to give uh, this love for uh, this video as well which we are going to discuss believe me guys this video will help you a lot in this session we will discuss what are the send in this is the on the latest san diego release tokyo was released but this is not any organization yet have promoted to the uh, uh, tokyo version so we will discuss uh, this all exam specification with respect to the san diego release okay so this is the official document of the service now in which we will discuss so guys let's start and please watch the video till the end okay so let's start and um, the condition is service now certified application developer in short we are saying the cad for this exam so okay so in this what is the introduction before entering in any field you should aware about the what are the advantages and how you know that help you to uh, your career okay in introduction the service now certified application developer exam specification define the purpose of audience testing options and examination content coverage like test framework and pre requests necessary to become a certified application developer okay to become a certified application developer definitely will help you to improve your career in service now even in term of your salary as well and service now you know a csa certified system administrator is the basic you know the uh, first step of the certification in service now this is the advanced step so once you certified application developer then you can implement as an specialist then you can uh, uh, you know technical architect i am planning to create a video for each uh, exam specifications which was uh, conducted by uh, the service now so in this video this is all with respect to the cad certified application developer the exam purpose of this uh, cad is to you uh, know uh, to uh, to uh, provide the better resource for any customer so that they can easily implement and customize the service now as per the business requirement so this is the main agenda behind this uh behind this exam okay so basically the service now certified application developer exam certified that a successful candidate has a capability and the skills and essential knowledge to develop the application to resolve your business problem both for their employer and sharing with the service now ecosystem this is the main advantage and the main purpose of the examination now who are the audience for this exam this is a basic question most of the guys are asking to me you know who can attempt this exam so mostly uh, audience is to be the customer you know uh, who are the customer of the service now partners employees and any other interested who is in become uh, who wants to become a service now certified application developer can appear in this exam okay for the exam preparation point of view exam question are based on the official service now training materials which was you know provided by the service now itself and also available in the product documentation site okay and there is a specific developer site as well so if you want to uh, take any uh, course or if you want to uh, you know uh, want any knowledge with respect to any specific topic you can go to the developer site or the community site 
or uh, service not documentation signed you can find out there okay so uh, these are the few conditions you need to meet like pre request in this path complete one of the following to attempt the cab to appear uh, for planning for appearing you should be clear about the service not fundamental so currently this service not fundamental on demand is free of course so if you still not registered the date is extended to 30th of october so go to the service now register yourself complete the service now fundamental then you are uh, comp complete the css certified system administration then you are eligible for this okay guys and the mandatory specialization is scripting in service now fundamental and application development fundamental so these uh, should be the you know pre request in this path okay so uh, recommendation and knowledge of education additional resource as i told you you can uh, check the service now documentation um you know the product documentation service now community service now you know uh, uh, developer website so there are lot of service now websites are available which will help you uh, while you are you know planning for this exam additional recommendation is this like six month hands on experience in developing the applications in service now because service now is the platform which ensure before publishing anything so that's why they required uh, you know uh, these these are the additional not a mandatory so if you have a 6 month or 1 year experience that will be good for you but if you don't have a 6 month experience then you are eligible you can appear for that not an issue at all okay the exam scope is very high these are the learning path design what exam will cover now the main important part the syllabus of the exam is we can discuss now okay this exam is containing these learning domains we can discuss the first chapter is designing and creating an application which will cover 20% of the exam in which we will discuss determine if a application is good fit for service now design and implement a data model create modules use applications scope okay now second is the application user interface this is also contain the 20% of the examination in this we will what we will learn create design customize form okay add remove field form on the tables write test and debug client side script business server side is so these things we will discuss in the application user interface which is taking the 20% of the exam weightage okay third one is the security and restricting access this is also taking the 20% of the exam in which what we will discuss we will discuss how can we restrict the access to the applications and applications modules automatically create the applications access controls manually create test and debug the access control list especially it it this module is focus on the uh, access control list or the security rules of the service now we can use the glide system methods to script security okay the now the next one is the application automation that is taking also 20% in this application automation we can write the test cases test scripts and debug the workflow and flow designer implement the documents fields create and use application properties and the create events schedule script execution send and receive email design and create home page and reports okay Next one is the working and external data. This is all. This is taking the only ten percent. In this, what we will discuss if we want to, you know, import any data in service now, like in form of the CSV or Excel. We are integrating, including testing and debugging. So such type of things, integration and the import uh, functionality, we will discuss in this, which is when the service now platform is communicating to the third party application or the external application. Then. Uh, that type of things we will cover in this chapter and it is taking the 10% weightage of the exam next is the managing applications managing applications is taking the 10% of the weightage of the examination and in the managing applications we will discuss download and installation of the application is delegated development to manage source code and code review and the service now git integration to manage source code so all of these things we will discuss i mean um, with respect to the service uh, now CAD. CAD means the serve again. I'm repeating again. CAD stands for Certified Application Developer. So in this exam, we will discuss all these things. Okay. Now, when whenever you clear, you need to register uh, similar like a BevSSR account. You need to register itself for that exam and pay the fees and take the slot, and then you are eligible for that. This is the exam uh, structure. I hope you all are aware. This is similar as. Uh, uh you know uh, the csa but i will i am repeating again the exam consists of approximately the 60 60 questions okay each question on the examination there are multiple possible responses the person take the exam review the options and select the most correct answer to the question 
okay multiple choice questions are there and select all that apply is applicable so you know uh, after completing and submitting the exam the pass or fail result is immediately calculated and displayed to the candidate more detailed result are not provided to the candidate but yeah you are fail or pass that will be after the finishing the exam you are eligible to take that that is similar like a rest of the exam like a csa okay these are some sample questions like a service now desktop applications automatically run on which platform so these are few you know the options like desktop smartphone or tablet so we can consider the most correct one like answer is so such type of questions are coming uh, in in the cad okay i hope you enjoyed this video if you if you are planning for the certified application developer program any question related to certified application developer examination please reach out to me mail me message me or if you are looking for any service now training guys please reach out to me we are conducting the ongoing program on 5th of september we have a few uh, training programs are running okay so uh, uh, we are happy to help you guys and thank you so much thank you so much for your love and thank you so much for watching the video